I think it all starts even before you get out on the court. You know, what you do to get yourself mentally prepared for the match, for you know, to get yourself in the right state of mind where you are, you know, calm, composed, serene enough, but yet you have the right intensity and the drive and motivation to, to play well and, and, and be dynamic and fast on the courts. Beautiful. So he's just pointing out it starts before you get on the court. And that's just this idea of, I guess, daily habits, practice. Well, if we want to grow and become more resilient or whatever the pursuit is that we are pursuing, it takes a lot of effort and practice. It's not just when it's showtime or game time. So for any job, any profession, anything we want to do, he's just pointing to the fact that there's more than just working on the shot, working on the backhand, learning how to serve. There's a whole other realm of preparation and practice that goes into performing at one's best. Yeah. And and I think also, sometimes I think, I mean, I definitely make this mistake of thinking I've done my homework and I'm just going to show up at something, whether it's, you know, teaching at the University of Toronto or, you know, playing a tennis match. Uh, and thinking that I'm going to sort of like stumble in into that new place, like hop out of the car and and just start doing what I've been physically practicing doing for mm -hmm. the past mm -hmm. few months or few years. And it never ends up working like that. So even with work, I find before I have to give a lecture or, or, or run a class, I often have to go to the like I often just like go to the washroom and I'll look at myself in the mirror and say, like, all right, let's let's go. Let's let's like bring bring passion bring commitment to teaching. Let's, let's, let's do this. The times when I don't do that for if I'm rushed, if I'm stressed about something, I forget it's, it's hard. It's, it's tough for me to get up to that <laughs> level. So what Novak here is talking about, or what Djokovic is talking about serene, you gotta be serene and intense. Yes. And that's a yes, strange yes, combination. Yes, yes, yes. Um, so that little bit of mental prep before whatever you do, whether it's tennis, anything work related, even if it's, you know, if you're going to have a stressful conversation, with a parent or a loved one, if you're about to go on a date, sometimes just like a few minutes of like, all right, where do I need to be? And just get yourself going. I think it's super useful. I've yeah. definitely experienced the cost of not doing that <laughs> and the benefits of doing it. It's yeah. Really amazing. yeah, yeah. I am very grateful that you watched to the end of this video. Please click one of the boxes to watch more of our content and otherwise have a great day. Peace out. <laughs>